Farming is many things. It is a lifestyle. It is a tradition. It is the desire to grow crops so that people around the world will have something to eat. And it's about making a profit. To make a profit, you need healthy plants. And to grow healthy plants, you need good levels of nutrients, soil organisms, water, and sunshine. Of course, all plants, healthy or not, need nutrients. In a natural setting, bacteria refine nutrients from the smallest component of soil, clay particles, and from humus, which is made of decaying organic matter. Nutrients are concentrated where bacteria live and are often taken up by the plant directly while others are transported to the roots by activities of larger organisms, like nematodes and fungi. With this network of supporting life forms, plants maintain the nutrient levels they need to grow. When the plant dies, most of these nutrients are returned to the soil and become the nutritional foundation for the next plant that grows there. On the other hand, Farming requires the crop to be removed, and along with it, so are many nutrients. Since plants need nutrients, and with harvesting, the soil inevitably becomes depleted, farmers are required to apply fertilizer. Typically, NPK fertilizer blends are used since these three are by far the largest component of soil nutrients found in plants. Unfortunately, high concentration of these fertilizers can drastically reduce the population levels of the soil organisms that help supply these and other nutrients to the plant. Another challenge is that different geographic regions have varying pH levels, restricting the type of crops that may be successfully grown. So, when trace elements need replacing, and adding fertilizer to the soil is detrimental to them being absorbed, or when the soil's pH restricts nutrient availability, how then can we get all the nutrients into the plant? Plants need a balance of many different nutrients to grow. With favorable growing conditions, these macro and micronutrients influence plant size and health, determine a plant's susceptibility to disease and pests, and control the quantity and quality of the yield. All plant nutrients come from one of two places, the air and the soil. The bulk of the soil originating nutrients are referred to as macronutrients and are common fertilizers. Although micronutrients are needed in very small amounts, they are nonetheless essential to plants and provide much needed benefits. When there is a deficiency or excess of one or more nutrients, the health of the entire plant suffers. The leaky barrel theory clearly shows the need for all plant nutrients in proper proportions. For instance, without proper availability of iron, plants may have problems during photosynthesis which is the process that is most essential to all other plant processes. With poor iron availability, plants struggle to fix nitrogen and can display symptoms of poor leaf health and stunted growth, resulting in an inferior crop even if all other nutrients are available in the proper amounts. BFP Foliar Fertilizer is a service designed by a team of experts to deliver a precise amount of selected micro and macronutrients to the plant, helping the crop grow to its fullest health and yield potential. Since our beginning, BEST has researched and studied the processes that help plants grow. As this science has progressed, we began to focus on the most effective way to deliver essential plant nutrients. 
Our foliar fertilizer is the culmination of work between our soil and plant division, best certified sales staff, and farmers from around the world. This has resulted in foliar applications that are blended to optimize the health of specific crops. Once the nutritional requirements are understood, specific blends of nutrients are applied as a foliar. Applying nutrients directly onto the leaves is superior for many reasons. The absorption of fertilizer as a foliar application is about four times more efficient than granular application. Globally, typical fertilizer application varies between 70 and 280 pounds per acre or 30 to 130 kilograms per hectare while BFP foliar fertilizer requires about two and three quarter pounds per acre or about one and a half kilograms per hectare. The vast majority of the foliar blend falls on the leaves so almost all nutrients are absorbed by the plant. Since there is minimal spill onto the soil there is little or no toxic effect to the soil life resulting in better environmental support for soil microbes which further supports plant health. The nutrients are absorbed directly by the leaf stomata so the benefits are quickly seen by the plant. As the nutrients are absorbed, they activate the power of other nutrients. Since nutrients are absorbed directly into the plant, the unavailability of these trace elements due to soil pH, compaction, use of harsh chemicals, dry spells, waterlogged roots and other soil conditions are avoided. Other major benefits of BFP foliar fertilizer is that four micronutrients are chelated Non-chelated micro and macronutrients typically react with themselves and other chemicals, binding them together and making them unable to be used by the plant. The chelating process, used with the BFP foliar fertilizer, ensures that the nutrients will enter the plant in a stable and usable form, and also allows farmers to tank mix it with most applications like broadleaf herbicides and insecticides. Growing healthy plants that are capable of producing large, high-quality crops should be the goal of every farming operation. By identifying soil and plant tissue deficiencies, the BFP, or Best Farming Practices Foliar Program, brings these nutrients back into proper balance and sustainability, helping farmers grow the best, most profitable crops.